Hi guys. Today me and Elia are going on a little adventure. We're going to the bins. Olivia's first time. Yeah. And I'm just in search of some like good mom jeans or like mom shorts, you know? But the trick is um you can't try anything on. So yeah. It works, it works. Hi guys. As you can tell, it's pretty early in the morning. So, we're in for a... Call really. It is! It's 8 o'clock! Oh. So, if you guys don't know what the bins are, you should definitely look it up because it's kind of cool. Oh, well in Morocco, let me tell you. Oh. You go to the Suk, or the market, and all those clothes laying on the ground there, are from Goodwill bins. So all the clothes that don't get bought at the bins get sent to um, other countries. So. Okay, well, see you in the next clip. So you kind of start digging. Did you find anything, Elio? No, I'm just getting really itchy. Actually, we found a few things. Yeah, we did. Oh it looks so gross. Start digging into it. Say hi. Oh. <laughs> you stopped. Oh, no, I didn't. Did I hear it? I don't know if we found anything good. I think we did. I'm still looking for some nice vintage jeans. Well, I know. Ellie doesn't like the jeans I found, but. I think they're cute. So, yeah. So, we found a few things. We did not find Levi shorts, but Lydia found some jeans. Uh, yeah. Okay, so these are the first ones. They're kind of big, but I'm thinking about cutting them into shorts. And then I found these ones, which are a little bit smaller. And then Ellie found this really cool shirt, but I bought it. And how much did your three items cost? Three items costed $6. I'll show you what I bought. Kind of looks like a brandy t-shirt. Lydia found some good shirts. So this is like a waffle material. It literally looks like the Brandy Mogul like flower thing. Yeah. I don't know how this is gonna work, but there are these like lavender like, how do you describe these pants? You know the grandma <gasps> pants? They're just like my favorite color, so yeah. And then I got a long sleeve, just basic, like, white, creamy turtleneck. Just a good layering piece. It's like a pink button-up, like, polo like, styled, sh styled shirt, but it's a dress. All those items were under $5. All those together cost me less than 5 bucks. So, so I don't know. We'll see if it's successful. We'll yeah. try to, like, you know, make them work. But, but now we're going to go to the... <sighs> More vintage bougie store. vintage stores like Fringe and Fray. And because I really just need some good Levi's for winter. Dude, same. But they're gonna be super spendy, but I'm willing to spend like $30. <gasps> I don't have any like jeans right now. <laughs> so I, them all I think up. the max I would pay is 20 Yeah. When I was digging through, I like felt this thing under my fingernail and I looked and there was like a black, <laughs> a black chunk. And then another time, I felt something really sticky on my finger and I looked at my finger and there's like a red slimy thing. Ew. So, was it blood? Ah, uh, no, I think it was like candy or something. So, you should go. Oh, we're going in here. Oh, oh. What's okay, happening? Okay. So there's nothing in Fringe and Fray, but there's still hope. Um, <laughs> yeah. That's all I wanted to say. Okay. <laughs> Ellie wore it to work, so I couldn't try it on, but that's it. 
Oh my gosh. Oh, I forgot one thing. <laughs> Carson is the biggest, biggest fan supporter. and the biggest supporter. Love you, Carson.